Pokemon and trainers learn much from battling. What's important is to never give up, even if you lose. Never gonna give you up. Never gonna let you down. Hello. Mm, I can smell it. I can smell it like here. Send up adventure. Oh, I might. Maybe I should get more Australian. I'll send up adventure. Give him the hat. You definitely want him to play the secret, uh, secret spots, right? I don't know what that is. There's enough spice in here to build a crazy super palace place. Oh, my name is not Arun. Oh, you cunt! Oi, my young Pokemon trainer. What can I do for you? Hey, what do you mean that you didn't ask for anything? Bet your heart didn't. No, no, no need to be sure. After all, we managed to mate. My name is Arun. Put it there. An overborn, 25 years old. Spent the last 11 years trying to find myself. Just a vagabond in search of dreams. This sounds like a sales pitch and he looks evil. I'm wandering around Owen, trying to find the perfect place where I really belong. That's right, a super secret base. You don't know about secret bases? What kind of love is that? Too sad, little bro. Or little cunt. Time to teach you a little lesson about Uncle Aru, right? Let's start with what a secret base is, which is adventure, romance, awesome. For real, it's the best place you ever want to chill. You and your pals, you'll get a gang and let them hang out and all that. Since you got this chance, y'all will learn how to make one. Take this. Ah, new move. Secret power can help you find the places and entrances and hidden places. These entrances are full of adventure, right? That is why I like to throw some spies in there and call them secret spots. Like this, see? This right here is a secret spot. Doesn't look like you can you could just climb up in this tree, right? This is exactly the kind of place to bust out with your secret power. Oh yeah! I never get tired of that. And that's always the finding secret spots and creating the entrance to your secret base. This move is crucial for having a secret base. Don't forget it now. Yeah, so you actually have some sort of player housing in this one. How fun. Hmm, not a bad layout. See, behind each secret spot you'll find spaces like this. They come in all kinds of shapes and sizes. So basically, whenever you find a secret spot, you ought to, ought to at least check it out with your secret power. Just think, someday, this place could be somebody's secret base, all decorated and filled with goods and friends, alright? I'd really love to see it like that. Wait a sec, you're not a cunt, ain't ya? But who in the world are ya? Alright, oh, you're self. Self. Sorry about that. I just got, uh, got, got on such a roll. I was gonna wrestle a croc, don't you know? Stick my finger up its butthole. So then, Sylph, how about I give you one more tip? When you feel happy about something, you ought to express that feeling. Put it into words, I'll, it'll cheer everyone up. So how about you tell me, huh? What spider you you like best? Uh, I mean, come on, tell Uncle Arun, what say that you're totally thrilled? Yay? No, that's not, uh... I, I, I know what to say to this gentleman. Uh, 
And it wouldn't be proper I'll say it if we didn't add the following word to it. There we go! Whis! Whee-hoo! Crikey, cunt! That's good! <laughs> now why I ask you that? Ain't it, ain't it obvious? It's cause I can see already that there's plenty of future to you to feel happy about. That's just how we roll in a secret base life. Every day is full of happy adventures all year. Now, I should go ahead and make my own super secret base right here, but I get the feeling this layout could be even better for you, little bro. That's not very Australian. Little cunt then. Guess, uh, guess I'm gonna leave this spot for you. I yeah, know, this, this spot is actually not that cool. This will be your secret base now on, little pal. No, it won't. It's yours now. So decorate it, destroy it, do whatever you want. Whatever floats your boat, right? All right, decorating. You see, any decoration you will uh, get will be sent to your PC and your secret base automatically. Place them around and liven up the base a bit. Yeah, that laptop thing. That there is a PC. No, it's a Mac. That's where you find your decoration. Now that you probably uh, have much right. Yeah, I'll give you these to get you started. Oh, right. One last thing. I'm a right down cunt, I am. You can do more than make your own secret base. You can visit other people's secret bases for a bit of fun. Aha, uh -huh, big of fun. <laughs> yes. If you find a base of a base that belongs to someone else, check it out. And here's the real point. When you check out someone's base, collect the flag you find next to your PC. <laughs> and something good might come of it. Looks like it's about time for me to head the road and search for the perfect base. Goodbye now, and uh, but hopefully I'll see you again, self, you bleeding cunt. If you need anything, try dropping me in at the secret base guild in Fortree. Yes, we will design a cool secret base eventually. Not this bloody thing. I don't want to live up in a tree. Uh, can I... Yeah, so now we can collect here, but hopefully we can move it to somewhere cooler. And we should check out what that secret uh, power move is and if it's actually useful in battle, because it is a also a battle move. So secret power, it's a normal physical move that does 70 damage and it's 100% accurate. That's pretty good. Where it was used can also be used to make secret bases. And everyone could learn it. You know, I think I might actually give this to um, because it's actually a fairly good normal move. I think of giving this to uh, yeah to War Face. Okay, what shall we throw out? Uh, that raises the stats. So yeah, it is... In general battle, we can forget Stomp here. The Stomp is really okay! But yeah, we'll teach a secret base, so... We can, you know, actually uh, go find a secret base somewhere in the future. Now onward to proper adventure. And we don't have a cutting Pokemon. Right, that is a problem. 
really have to learn that, uh, find a Pokemon that can learn that move. Or evolve our Pokemon to be able to learn that move. Let's fight children first, though. Always good to fight children first. Are you looking for Pokemon as well? No, you're not looking for Pokemon. You're running around in a circle, you derpy, creepy little girl. Ooh, 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 ooh. I like Spoink. Spoink is another one of my favorites. Hello, Joe. We just learned about secret bases from a crazy Australian. And now we run into Spike, who I really like. But this is a trainer battle, so sadly we won't be able to uh, fight it. Right, okay. Um, I'm just going to iron ahead this uh, stupid pick. Okay, well that was pointless. Here. Die. You can't see it. I would like maybe, uh, like, no, not a mainstream game, but maybe a fan game where you had the option to steal it. And you kind of had an alignment mo modifier for that. That would be cool. Uh, Mawile. Ooh. Mawile is Steel Fairy. Would be good against that. So, hmm. I think Electric might be good at it, so I'm going to switch to... Oh wait, Love Buzzer is injured. I don't think I want to take Love Buzzer against this. Uh, what I can do is uh, first move, throw Potion on... Love Buzzer, then go into the attack. I hope Love Buzzer will be well there. So we begin with a potion, because I don't trust it. Also totally smash on Maw while. Just be careful with that Maw. Just, you know, handle with care, but otherwise it could be an exciting smash, you know? <laughs> <laughs> So, Super Potion on Love Buzzer here. Okay, we're good. Right, time to start zapping it. Oh, that does not work as well as I thought it would. We have to be a little bit careful here then. Very good. Okay, we are... Now we are at a bit of risk here. I don't want to love. I don't want to risk Love Buster, so he is going to just get a potion. Because a bad hit could end Love Buster. Now, we probably finish this fight if we. Uh, oh, well, that's good. Now we finish the fight then. If we don't miss. But we don't. You're a strong trainer. Creepy. Please go away. I am looking for grass. We haven't actually caught anything on Route 111. So if we can find any sort of grass here. Rest stop! Okay, that is handy. So this is actual Pokemon Rest uh, Center. So we can heal up there. Paris. So 
But yeah, I've never played the Pokemon Coliseum games. They look they looked really cool back in the day, but I didn't have an Inter a Nintendo uh, 64. Nor have I gotten the GameCube or shit like that afterwards. I am not that much into Nintendo, usually. What shall we plant here? Oran berries. I want more oran berries. Water these plants. Now I saw an interesting route up uh, this way. And we can get to if we take our bike, so. There we go. Ah, we could make a secret base up here. Neat. Is there any Pokemon encounters here? Elixir? I don't know what that does. Let's fight this guy. <laughs> You're out here alone! You're about to get uh, fucked up, motherfucker! I do like that evolution of Zigzagoon, that looks kind of cool. That's, that's just Rock Smash! Vegeta! Yeah, normal type is not gonna do much damage against uh, our little boy here. smashing oh grounds that is not great actually oh okay that that's not nobody cares you die Dion I lost my way in battle too I was curious about some Pokemon tracks so I followed them and I got totally lost I don't see any Pokemon tracks here. Just, yeah, spots for the secret base. Which, I don't want to have a secret base up here that we can only reach with the bicycle here. Do think we'll have a little rest uh, with this old lady. Oh dear me, aren't you and your Pokemon exhausted? You ought to stop and rest a bit here. Yes, indeedy. That's exactly what you should do. Yes? That's right. Take your time and rest up here. <laughs> oh, dear me. Are you and your Pokemon still tired? She switched from old lady to master pain now. You should take another little rest, dear. Yes, indeed. That's what you should do. <laughs> no. Really? Are you sure that's wise? No need to be shy about it. <laughs> Anyways, on with our adventure. Hopefully we'll find a... Let's actually fight this kid and we have, it, have, have had it over with. Oh, he, he doesn't want to fight. Thank you. That's a bit late. Sod off, kid. I am looking for Pokemon. You want to fight? Yes, you do. Oh, you and your Pokemon look quite strong. We simply must have a battle. Psycho. She looks snazzy. Smash. Oh, 
Hmm. We do have rock moves. I think that's good against the uh, flyer. Yeah, that ain't gonna do shit. You cannot hurt our baby boy. Our baby boy can hurt you, though. <laughs> Bing! Level 25. Sexy, sexy defense. Oh, rock slide. Yes, let's see what's, what's rock slide about. 75 uh, damage with 90% accuracy. Large boulders hurt from the opposing Pokemon to flick damage. May also cause the Pokemon to flick. Compared to rock tune. It's 60 damage. And a 95%, so it's more accurate but less damage. I don't know, anyone have any suggestions on where... Uh, should we get uh, replace Rock Tomb with Rock Slide? Or should we replace Protect, maybe? Protect is very handy to ensure like, that de like a death move does not uh, instantly hit you. Reference, protect, enables the user to evade all attacks. Its chance of, fa of failing rises as it's used in succession. Yeah, so don't use it several times in a row. So how are we feeling? Should we replace uh, Rock Tomb or Protect or should we just leave uh, Rock Slide uh, at the wayside? I think I'll do I think I'll replace Rock Tomb because I think I have a TM of Rock Tomb. So I can always replace it back to Rock Tomb. Let's do that then. Got Rock Tomb and run Rock Slide. Numel! Wish I could send the electric Pokemon against that, but that is a poor idea. Um, let's switch Pokemon. No, I think this is a good shot for uh, Gip the T and the G Force. Pity you fools! Look how big and bulky he is. And with those derpy eyes. Yeah, that's definitely not the most flattering evolution. Now it dies. Bye. Roselia! That is a grass type Pokemon. Grass poison, I believe. Yes, let's switch to something else. Honestly, I, I think Love Buzzer can take this one. Love Buzzer can do this. Like, yes, the lightning moves are not gonna work, but he should be fine with his uh, normal and his uh, speedy attack. And the grass is not gonna do that much damage against him. So I think just biting him, her, will handle this. Brazilia has, by the way, smash. Just, you know, be, uh, beware of the thorns, but you have to beware of thorns with any woman, really. Mm -hmm. Jump, jump, jump! Mega Drain. That is a bit too much more edge point than I like. Okay, I think we need to switch out, because this uh, is too much hurting. And too much draining, because he's getting right back up there. Right. 
But his face is good against plants, so let's do this. See, that's a lot better. Alright, let's try out the Sil- Oh, it only has five moves? Hmm, might switch back to Struggle Buck then, but let's try the Silver Wind move that we learned. That seemed good. Air Cutter for the last bit. Yes! Level 25! That might mean evolution time! You didn't just look strong, you are strong! Yeah, the strength excites you, baby. Aw, oh, we didn't evolve! Aw. Oh. Um, I think I want to go back for resting for a bit, because we are kind of wanting to train up, um, yeah. Manectric uh, or electric to, to manectric. So let back to Master Pain. Ah, it's rest indeed. <laughs> rest up well. <laughs> no, we're not still resting, you creepy old woman. Think he wants to, she wants to put us and the Pokemon into the eternal rest. Speaking of which, let's actually switch out. Yeah, switch out Love Buzzer to the first spot. And continue its training. Yeah, okay, so route one. Route 111 uh, doesn't seem to have any grass or Pokemon or such to catch. But I don't think we've been to Route 1... Yeah, I'm pretty sure we've not been to 113. So, we have a shot here, after the battle with May. And the road here. Let's see, Metal Gear Solid for it. Mm, Metal Gear. Metal Gear. Crap battle. There we go. Mm. The road here was pretty long, huh? I got tired enough of that. I had to take a little break. Sylph, your Pokemon look pretty tired themselves. Let me take care of them for a sec. We just went to Master Pain to rest. Your team's health was restored. There, that's all better. I'm on my way to pay a visit to Professor Cosmo. He's famous for his research on meteorites. He was working on a project called Metal Gear with my dad, um, I mean Professor Bert, on how meteorites might affect Pokemon. Enough, darling. I think I have, it's not much further to Falabor. Let's give it our last push. Yes, and everyone, it is catching time again. So we are going to go in there and see what we can catch. I don't know what that is, but we'll sneak up on it. All right, what will we have? Skarmory! Skarmory is cool, I like Skarmory. Though honestly, it's not that great for this team, but fuck it. Okay, a bite. Yeah, that doesn't do much. Oh, right, we're not uh, dealing with my baby boy anymore. Good, always good. Paralyzed, good. I don't think we should Thunder Fang because that is probably like four times effective, I think. So the good thing Skarmory should be able to learn the cut move. 
and we need a cutter, but I don't know if, know if we want Skarmory for our main team. If we can catch her. We'll do one more bite. Please don't crit. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. Time for the Pokeball. Yeah, throw the balls at the bird. Yay! Though I really could have used the fire type maybe a bit more. Oh well. Registration complete. Skarmory is entirely encased in hard protective armor. This Pokemon flies at close to 190 miles per hour. It slashes foe with its wings that possesses a sword-like cutting edge. At us. What shall we name this, uh, this steel bird lady? If I may put her in my own uh, thing in the hat, Robot Chicken. What's the thing that they called, uh, you know what, uh, the thing in Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridge, the drop that God card? Super Mega Ultra Chicken? Chop Suey? Hmm. Joe, do you have any suggestions for Big Metal Bird Lady? Also, Skarmory never evolves, I believe, so the way Skarmory looks is the way Skarmory is going to be remaining looking. I think I will go with my original robot chicken uh, idea. Reference to my favorite show, so I like it. if it fits actually yeah it just fits robot chicken go yeah I don't know if Skarmory actually fits well in our current team but he is cool <laughs> 